drive by in your company van like a complete ass hat, I probably won't call you to come fix my motherfucking ass, my motherfucking ass, ah, anything. My house, my fucking ass, ah, I said. Ah, I wouldn't call you to, I wouldn't call you to come fix an ass, an ass, an ass. What is it you do? Oh, auto detailing. Oh, the guy came racing by everybody going 55 miles an hour here, 25, running down old women and chickens and things. I would call you come detail my car. I wouldn't have you detail my details for that matter. God damn it. You know, some people, you look at them and you can see, well, you can see the wear of time on people if they've been around for a minute. And if it's been uh, on a working person, you can see it. You can see it on them. You can see it in their hands. You can see it in their face. You can see it on their eyes. And I don't care if that work was. It doesn't matter. If you've been one of affluence, you wear it on your face as well. It's like this puffy. Always had enough. Stress is not normal. Stress is oh, what if? You know, I don't know, it's not, I'm not, I'm going to lose my home, it's, I don't know what their stress is, to be honest with you, <laughs> I'm not them, but, and I was mean they're bad people, I think we just, we are what we are, man, I don't know, but you wear it on you, man, whatever you are, whatever you've been, you wear it on you, doesn't mean it's a bad thing, it just is what it is. Excuse the ruckus, we got people pounding drive, driving pilings. Here's an old trick. A young timer taught me. When you cut an edge and you gotta put it in a situation where you don't want them to see, you don't want them to see any light and it's far enough away where they can't scrutinize it too much and where you might have a little chip out. It's better than restaining it and wait for it to dry again. Take a black sharpie. And you can sharpen them. Block out the edges. And if you're really in a situation, you can block out the whole thing. And that way, no light reflects out of that corner that it's going in. And you won't be revealing yourself as having not stained it. Tips and tricks from G Town 10 when you use a black sharpie, remember where you put the freaking cap as. Where'd the goddamn thing go? Son of a bitch, motherfucker. Boy, he, he loves to eat weeds. Just a weed eater. Look at him go. Can't help himself. Might be weed eating. Not oh, there's his partner. Partner in crime. There he goes, primary weed eater. There he goes. Ah, just like catching the Sasquatches. Like catching the Sasquatches. <laughs> Playing freaking trapper. Holy. That's a big one. That's a big one. Nice, nice. Yeah, I wouldn't paint that. Fuck that. Tell off he's too dangerous. I'm gonna try to spray it out. Spray it, spray it cause I, up under the pork he want uh, prime too, so I might as well do it all in one shot. Yeah. Spray that. I'm gonna see how strong of a pattern I nope. get on. No, that's just dead. Yeah, that's an old rusty one. We got another one. The bristles are all shiny. Because it's a stainless steel one. That's the one he's looking for because it doesn't get in his paint. Uh, just burp smoke. Oh. I'm gonna smoke. You be careful, man. Joe, how are you gonna get back down? God, you did that like you fucking do it every day. Crazy fucker. Look at this, son of a bitch. I gotta get this on film. What if you fall? Look at that. He just climbed up off that little ladder. If I get a mirror, put it right there. Careful. God dang it. Are you careful? Now, you want someone to hold the ladder for you? 
<laughs> You're lucky somebody's here. I'm serious. I've been stuck because it's easy to get up from that, but it's harder to get back down. Yeah, it is, man. I was born on a ladder. That's why I fell from a ladder. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Hey, hey, Carefully. I grab a roof, a piece of a roof, my fail would have been harder. Can you flip it around? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait. <laughs> Can you pull a ladder out from underneath me? Yeah, fuck, Joe. That's not easy. Right. Holy, it's fuck cold out. Just <laughs> not cold. Just fucking storming like a motherfucker. It's only 87 page fucking instruction booklet. <laughs> Sorry, man. Hey. Uh, fucking. I don't even know what to say, man. So, this is the final. Right here. Final requirement. For my MPA, just close the door on it. And you don't see these every day either. Holy shit. That's awesome. Freaking cool, man. Cool. Old part all over the place. <laughs> 